Pansy, and today I have a humongous, jimongous, timongous, wimongous, fimongous, what am I saying, huge winter haul for you guys, featuring a whole bunch of different stores. We have everything from a drugstore at CVS, to Macy's, to Target, to ra just random, just, just random. And of course there's going to be a try-on, so anything I mention, you will see how it looks, what it looks like, that's the same thing, why did I say that twice? I'm an idiot. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. We can start out with Macy's because I feel like that's the biggest purchase because I kind of just, you know, ran around Macy's and just picked up a whole bunch of different stuff. So yeah. The very first thing has been long overdue and a long time coming and it is a leather jacket. Of course, fake leather because, you know, ain't nobody got money for real leather. Well, you maybe you do, but I, I don't. But I'm absolutely in love with this leather jacket. Over Thanksgiving break, I actually bought another leather jacket, and it just looks so bad on me. A, the cut and the fit is just not right. Uh, it's from JCPenney. But also, I got it in a medium, and it's just way too big, and it's just not me. Oh my gosh, ew, I tried wearing this leather jacket out. I literally look like some sort of, like... Like like a the, like a bouncer at like a bar, you know what I mean? Like the bouncer. Like I don't look like I belong at the bar partying. I look like I belong at the door kicking people out. This leather jacket is goals. Ew, did I really just say that? The next thing I got is like a little suit, a little suit set. Yes, your your girl's a businesswoman, what can I say? And it is a tan blazer suit type thing with the matching pants, of course. And it's by Calvin Klein, which if you guys don't know, Calvin Klein is my go-to work outfit brand it is just I think Calvin Klein is just the best and if you guys don't know I never shop name brand anything like if you look like this right here this is this is I think Toby you know like six dollars uh, but I do feel like for when you're buying work attire that type of stuff invest 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 in some really good quality stuff because for example I'm I'm, I hope to be wearing this. Cross your fingers, you know. I'm really messy. I get stains on everything, but I hope I can wear this for years and years to come. Um, but yeah, I think that this tan, oh my gosh, it's just such a pretty color. I just, I mean, I love what I'm going on and on about the color tan, but I don't know. It's just like, it's just, it reminds me of the sand at the beach. Also from Calvin Klein, I got this blouse, which this is like a really pretty white blouse. Just, you know, like a classic work blouse. But what I love about it is like the gold detailing. The buttons are all gold. I think it's just like a really fresh, fresh blouse. And I'm kind of in love. And the last thing from my main man, Calvin, is this blouse. And it's just, you know, a classic, classic white blouse. Um, and I, I love like the scoop neck and like the cinching here. I think it's so pretty. And um, I really like the material as well. And it'd be like perfect to wear either by itself or under a blazer. Speaking of blazers I got this really cool uh, it's like a magenta I guess first of all I just want to say I'm not really the biggest fan of this color but it is like does have a pop of color and I like kind of like it it's not just like the boring gray black tan nude white you know that type of thing it kind of reminds me of like a space a space outfit I don't know it reminds I feel like if I ever go to space I'm gonna be like hey let me get my this is by Tahari let me get my Tahari blazer and then we can go to space together you know Ah, uh, I have, what was that? Oh, uh, but I have a question. If you were given the opportunity to travel to space in like a space shuttle, would you go or what? Like, I honestly don't know. That's really scary. And to be in space, like to be in space, that's really scary. I honestly don't know. I feel like, uh, I feel like I'd have to, but like, that's really, tell me what you would do in a comment down below. Seriously, let me know. Yeah, you're nice to the aliens. Let me know. Then from Century 21, which is similar to like a Macy's, JCPenney department store type thing, I got this skirt, which is like, you know, wear like a blouse, long work skirt, which I think is just so pretty and so flattering and it just fit me so well, which sometimes things don't always fit me. I don't, you know, when things don't fit you right, well, guess what? This fits me and I'm happy. <laughs> and then the last thing on this whole workflow type thing is this pair of shoes. And you might be thinking, Clancy, these are the ugliest things I've ever seen in my life. And to that, I say, you know what? No, because let me tell you, these are from Naturalizer and shoes. Shoes, what can I say? They can be some of the most uncomfortable things in the world. They can ruin your life. They really can. And I don't want to be uncomfortable in heels all day at the office or wherever I may be. But at the same time, I also don't want to be in boring old flats. So these guys, these, these, these are so comfy. They're actually specially made so that um, you can... By the way, in case you're wondering, I'm like touching the bottom. I haven't used these yet. You know what I mean? So like, I can literally lick this if I want. They're so comfortable and they're actually made for you to endure a full work day. Like I wish you would just, everyone just come over to my house right now and just feel these. Like they don't feel like normal shoes and even the leather is so soft. So in case you're wondering, I'm a size 8. If you ever want to buy me shoes, uh, feel free size 8. No, I'm kidding. They're practical, okay? Not the hottest heels on the universe, but you know, they're practical. 
I feel like a four-year-old woman right now. Let's get into like Target and other stuff so I could feel a little less old, okay? So at Target, I picked up, it was like this deal, like two for 22, something like that. And I picked up this, whoa, this shirt right here, right his here. I really just wanted a solid, tight shirt to wear underneath a vest because I've been very into the vests lately, the vest life, even though I only own like two, whatever, you know, I'm into it, okay. So I picked up this one and then I also picked up this other one which I really was like, yes, this is going to be so great. It's a little too big on me though, it's not tight, so I'm really upset about it and I was going to return it, but then I went to return it and like the line was so big and I was like, you know what, let me just buy my dog some treats anyway. If you follow me on Snapchat, you know about that. Kind of reminds me like of being a criminal which I just feel like, you know, it lets me express like my, my evil side. When I wear it, it lets people know, like, yeah, I do bad things. Yeah, shirt. Sure. Then I went to the Gap, and I had the same thing in mind with getting a solid, tight shirt to wear under a vest. Then I just got this solid white one. Solid white. Yeah, white. I don't know what I'm saying. Shifting gears a bit, I hit up Sephora. It sounds like I, like... I hit it up like I blew it. I blew it up? No, I didn't. Okay. Both of them are actually repurchases, so both of these things you know I love, so... I don't know. It's exciting. First thing is the Laura Mercier Silk... Okay, I know it's pronounced Laura Mercier, but I love saying Mercier. Mercier. Okay, whatever. The Laura Mercier Silk Cream Photo Finish Foundation. This guy right here. Let me open it up and show you. I'm in the color Sand Beige, and oh my word, guys, this foundation is my glory. I've tried numerous other foundations. Not that many, but I've tried a lot of others. Nothing compares to this baby in my book. Like, I just think it's just so natural, but it also gives you coverage, and I just, I love it. Love it. Love it. And the best feeling ever is when you, like, find your shade. You know what I mean? Like, your shade. The other thing I got, I love near, it's just, it's just, it's near and dear to my heart, and I, I will... I will marry it, maybe. I don't know. Ooh, this is just, oof, just holding it. I'm just like, wow, like, I'm holding it. Like, And it is the NARS Lip Gloss in Turkish Delight. People, if you don't own this, buy it. A lot of people have been asking what color has been on my lips lately, and right now, NARS Turkish Delight. That's all I can say. Let me put a little bit on. Just a little dab. Oh, I just... My lips are thanking me already. No, but seriously, this is this 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 is bomb.com. I just stuttered hardcore. And the last place I went to is no other than drum roll, please. CVS! So yes, I went to CVS and let's just get right into it. The first thing I got is the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Eraser Dark Circles. Everyone, everyone and their mother has this. It's great. I Love this stuff, and I can on Whoa, come to me, light. Come to me. Okay. I like this better than the high-end stuff. I've tried MAC. I've tried... What was the other one I tried? I forgot the other one. It was like Bobby Brown, I think. I don't know. I've tried everything. Not everything, but a lot. And I keep going back to the Maybelline um, Adri Wand. It's just beautiful. I got it in the shade Light Pale, because I'm light pale. Um, no, but even if you are a little bit darker, go down a couple of shades because it's under your eyes. You want it to be bright, not like a dark... Mm. So yeah, this stuff is just amazing. Then I got some stockings. So interesting. Bam! And these are just the Silken Mist Silky Sheer Leg. And I got it in the color Nude because I am a nude person. I don't know. That's just what. And the last thing I picked up are these four mini notebooks. First of all, I don't know. Notebooks just give me life, guys. Do they just give me life? Like, look at this. Let's. Let, which one should we look at? Let's look at. Let's look at the one with the design. You know, so interesting. Oh, just look at it, guys. It's like a notebook with lines, and you can write on it. That's just awesome. Oh. So those are all my purchases and my winter haul for you guys, ranging from fashion to makeup to notebooks. So yeah, there you have it. But yeah, so if you guys enjoyed this video and would like to see more and you're not already subscribed, then be sure to hit that subscribe button down below. And be sure to be following me on Instagram, Twitter, all of that good stuff if you'd like to stay up to date on my day-to-day -day happenings, as well as Snapchat. I've been snapping a lot lately, so get on that. So yeah, I'm gonna go, but I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.